Decades over just about every major event in America, you could find the Goodyear blimp giving us a view from above. Expo 74 was one of those events. Take a look at this vintage Air Force adventure. For decades, America has watched sporting events through a lens mounted on the Goodyear blimp. In 1974, one of the famous blimps called the Spokane Airport home. This is it, the Columbia being launched to fly over Expo 74. The KXOI crew went along for the ride. The film shows the blimp flying over Spokane from the west. You can see I-90 and the railroad tracks below. And take a look at this, the Monroe Street Bridge, a row of railroad warehouses instead of Kendall Yards on the west side. The now blue bridge is actually red and white. The beauty of the Spokane River and the falls is on full display, just what the city had hoped for. This is the Soviet pavilion from above. It's now the Lilac Bowl. You can follow the trail of visitors and see the riblet chairlift crossing the river and Washington Street. The clock tower, just as it stands today. The large white building on the right is the Republic of China pavilion. The honeycomb looking building, the Japanese pavilion. The yellow and red dome, the Kodak pavilion. Naomi Rogers, wife of then Spokane Mayor David Rogers, said her greatest thrill of Expo 74 was piloting the blimp as it hovered over the park. 